Well, I just got done speaking with the sheriff. Now, these patrols that we're talking about happened in the downtown area. Here's a little breakdown of the numbers. So since August 1st, the sheriff's office conducted 371 traffic stops and handed out 129 citations during those stops. There were 59 citations where narcotics were seized, the sheriff's office saying most of which were marijuana. There were 24 guns that were seized during their operation, and there were also 16 warrant arrests conducted since that August 1st start date. This is all part of what the sheriff's department is calling the downtown safety patrol, working in partnership with already existing Cleveland police efforts. This effort is downtown Cleveland. It touches everyone. People who live outside the county or in other parts of the county, their family and friends come downtown, whether it's to go to a sporting event, to go to dinner, to have a good time, to come down here for business, to go to the federal building, whatever it might be. So people come downtown and they expect a level of safety, and we're here to certainly support that. Now with this program's success, there is no sign of stopping it anytime soon. Betsy? Well, I would wonder too, Emma, you know, what is the city saying about all of this? Well, I just got a statement from the city. They say they are greatly appreciative for the support from the sheriff and his team in keeping the downtown neighborhood safe. I can only imagine they are very appreciative, and all of us who work and live downtown are appreciative, too. Emma Henderson, live for us, downtown Cleveland. Thanks.